Mean Review. It's a show I watched as a child that died just like my hopes and dreams of becoming a lawyer, a doctor, maybe even an astronaut. Instead, I sit here going to work nine to five, looking out at the sky, crying out to Jesus, asking him, is this what I was made for? And as usual, he doesn't respond. And so I get home and make a YouTube video to make myself feel better. That's right, baby. I'm going to be laughing at unfortunate souls, unfortunate idiots, because guess what? My life is a meme. My life is nothing but a joke. So let's take Mick and laugh for other people's misfortunes and embarrassments, all right? So, let's delve in. Strap yourselves in, because we are just about to go on the most exciting roller coaster your butt cheeks have ever engaged in, mate. Clench them hard and tense your tits, because my God. <laughs> <laughs> now, my chat game is not there. I'm not going to pretend, you know, I'm a silky smooth operator who's going to get in there and get the nudes and then leave because that's just not going to happen, mate. It just doesn't happen, you know what I mean? It doesn't happen. You bet your fucking bottom bing, bam, boom that I ain't going to be sending teeth pics like that. Like, Jesus, Lord. Oh, God, it just gets worse. Oh, my God, he's got tits. He has man boobs. I mean, it's cool. You know what I mean? Switching genders, you know, like you're crossing the road. It's cool, bro. I don't care. But look at the seas and them fucking watermelons. Why would you want to get rid of them fucking th If I tits like that, mate, you bet your fucking bum cheeks I'd be shaking them around. You ain't nothing but a hound dog while I shake my big fucking... Uh... Give me a chance. I'll treat you right. And you don't know, maybe I'll put a ring on that finger someday. Give me... I think if anyone sent me videos like this, I think the ring would be getting shoved firmly up your ass crack, mate, for the sun not to see, because you and that fuck Like, a bit, I really want to know what's going on with the, the, the boobies, you know what I mean? Is that just moobs? Like, uh, again, I don't care if you're fat, bro, but I think it's important we get these, uh, you know, these determining factors out there. Am I looking at boobs, like men boobs? You know, you switch ships and you've, you've gone to a woman, or is that just too many Mackie D's in the system? Which, again, is cool, bro. You know what I mean? You do you, booby. I'm just happy you're slaying the game and not getting taken the piss out of the internet. <laughs> Holy fuck. Holy hell. I mean, you've got to give it to him. At least he tried. The mind tried. Uh, he tried giving us a vocal session. His music teacher won't be too pleased that he did it. Uh, he thinks, you know, having a, a, a tin of cider is, you know, getting on the fucking lash. Uh, he, he's obviously, you know, not listening to, you know, that his PP pee -pee is leading the action. He's thinking with his hips and not with his head, which is a common a common um, factor, a common feature of being a male. Uh, I admit, you know, I'm a male. Sometimes you have a, you know, you smell alcohol and suddenly it's, you know, you're following something that doesn't have your best interest at heart, your penis. Good luck to this guy. I mean, if he ever does get Poonani, I think that means that there's actually some chance we can all get it because this guy does not give me any sort of vibes of as a competent person. He's probably, you know, on the spectrum slightly, so why do we laugh? But I treat everyone equally if you're on the spectrum or not. You know what I mean? So you're welcome. I'm Mr. Good Guy. Now, something I can't really show, I don't think, but I'm just going to sort of blur it. You've probably seen the clip, and I just wanted to say that this is crazy. This is... This man got famous on the internet because he, um, well, he fisted what can only be presumed as a, uh, a dead human being. Or, I don't know, is it rubber? Oh, maybe it's not rubber. I mean, maybe it's not real. I, I mean, I just had to click on this and just to ask you, saying, what is the world becoming? Um... Look, I've I've been doing YouTube videos for a decent amount of time now. Uh, you know, I've not quite hit the the mainstream. Not yet. We'll hit it soon. Do I need to do something a bit outlandish? You guys can let me know because at this stage, I'm willing willing to sacrifice my testicles to God in order to see something. Because it, it pisses me off when you see people like this fisting plastic and getting fed. You know, it's just dog shit. Kill me fucking end my life. Now, what I love nothing more is than people being um, exposed, and this video is a man who called his girlfriend, and let's just say she had moved on while still being his girlfriend. Yo, where are you at? Outside. Outside where? Outside. Where? I don't know. Wait, so do you need a ride? Hello, can I get my stuff or no? Yo. Yo. There you go. Okay, can I get my stuff or no?
<laughs> so if you listen very carefully, there's some inappropriate behaviour going on in the background. I'm not going to play it all, but his name's Oblivion, called his girlfriend, to just to find out she was getting, uh, well, um, plowed. Yeah, this is the villain origin story, literally, bro. This is the end. Now, we've got one more clip, so strap in. It's probably the most funniest one because it's basically like a marathon and um, basically, <laughs> just watch, it's hilarious. Watch everyone's reactions involved. <laughs> So she just got caught grinding of another man. See, this is just like nature. You know what I mean? They've done something good. They're covered in paint, probably, you know, on a shit ton of Red Bull by the look of it. And she's going to shake her fucking bum. She's like a fucking dog on a walk that smells another nice little pooch. Go, oh my God, it's a dog. I want to hump. I want to hump. I want to hump. Women are doing the same thing. You see it all the time these days. They're looking for any sort of... And then she pulls a trick as in, yeah, didn't feel right. <laughs> What, it felt like a black man's penis rubbing against you, did it? Or not? You tell me. You tell me, bitch. Oh my god. Look at that. <laughs> he's loving it here. She's like, what the fuck? That's not him. And then he's like, oh, what the fuck? That's my bitch, motherfucker. What's she doing? <laughs> Obviously, it's all for the games, and I'm sure he understood because these things can happen. You know, you want to grind on someone, so you find the the closest black penis that you can find. I just love that he's grabbing his glasses like Tony Stark. Like, Hold on, let me just uh, put these fake glasses on just so I can pretend to see better. Yeah, that's definitely my girl, and that's definitely not me. Um, hold on a fluffy minute. What's going on? What's going on? Now I hate this bitch here, so we're going to end on here. Her dancing needs to be put in the bin. Uh, you know, it's like some mouldy food that's been left in your fridge for half a year. It's just absolutely mutated into some sort of creature, and this creature is Jojo Siwa. Siwa. I was, I'm, I'm probably going to make a full video on this uh, child dancing like an absolute fucking donk and again it's pure hatred pure jealousy i hate my life everything i've uh, haven't achieved this woman's achieved far more than i will ever achieve and all she does is some horrific it was like she's having a fit you know some sort of like epileptic seizure and dances and get millions and i'm just gonna go find the closest noose and stick my head through it i think that sounds like more fun than watching goodbye see you tomorrow bitch